Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and in this video I'm gonna compare the new Nokia 7 Plus and the OnePlus 5T. The Nokia is costing about 400 bucks while the starting price for the 5T is 499. So let's get into the video and starting off with the construction, both handsets are coming with fully aluminium body. The screen size is same as well which is 6 inch and it's longer 18 by 9 in aspect ratio. So in terms of the size of these phones, both are almost the same where the Nokia is gonna be a bit more longer than the OnePlus 5T. As for the screen to body ratio, it's gonna be higher on the 5T which is 80% versus its 77% on the Nokia 7 Plus means the bezels are gonna be thinner on the OnePlus 5T. We are gonna have on screen controls on both handsets and the fingerprint scanner is on the back and both handsets are also gonna have facial recognition feature. There is gonna be USB type C port on both handsets and the headphone jack is there as well and at last both phones are not gonna have any certified protection against water. The display is AMOLED on the 5T versus IPS LCD on the Nokia 7 Plus. The screen resolution is same on both handsets which is Full HD Plus so they are gonna be 400 pixels per inch on both handsets. The color reproduction is gonna be good on the OnePlus 5T and the handset supports HDR videos and as it's an OLED screen on the handset it's also capable of always on display. At last for the display both phones are gonna have Gorilla Glass display protection so yeah. Coming to the performance and we are gonna have Qualcomm Snapdragon 660 on the Nokia 7 Plus versus Snapdragon 835 on the OnePlus 5T. So the OnePlus is definitely gonna be ahead here and as for the RAM it's gonna be 4GB on the 7 Plus which is good versus its 6 and 8GB of RAM variants on the 5T means it's gonna be able to store even more running apps in the background. Both handsets are coming with 64GB of internal storage while there's also gonna be a 128GB variant of the 5T but this storage can't be increased on the handset versus we can increase it on the Nokia 7 Plus. As for the camera and it's gonna be 12 megapixels on the Nokia versus 16 megapixels on the OnePlus 5T and the aperture size is slightly larger on the 5T. Both handsets are coming with a secondary sensor so it's gonna be another 12 megapixel sensor on the Nokia 7 Plus and it's a telephoto sensor so we are gonna have two times optical zoom feature on the handset versus it's 20 megapixels color sensor on the 5T and it's not telephoto nor wide angle so it's gonna help the main sensor in taking good pictures. And on both handsets, we can take portrait images, which is good. And one last thing, the camera on the 7 Plus is gonna be tuned by Carl Zeiss Optics. So yeah, we are gonna have face detection for refocusing on the OnePlus 5T versus dual pixels face detection on the Nokia for even faster refocusing speed. And both are gonna have electronic image stabilization. Both can record 4K videos and we can record 120fps 720p slow motion videos on the OnePlus 5T versus it's not confirmed for the Nokia 7 Plus but it should be the same as the OnePlus 5T which is 120fps 720p slow motion videos. As for the front camera, both handsets are coming with 16 megapixels front camera with aperture f2.0 and the sensor size is also the same on both handsets. At last for the battery and it's gonna be larger 3800mAh on the Nokia versus 3300mAh on the OnePlus 5T. Both handsets are not coming with wireless charging feature and as for the fast charging it is present in both handsets and the 5T is one of the fastest in recharging. So yeah. So this is it for this video guys. Let me know what do you guys think about both handsets and I will see you guys in my next video. Peace out.